G'day, welcome to Todd's Kitchen. Ice cream is incredibly delicious, but there's one thing that makes it better and that's a topping. So I'm not gonna make the boring old type right now. I'm gonna make a self-setting topping that goes nice and hard on top of the ice cream. So join me today as I make my version of ice magic. Now to start this recipe off, you want a microwave safe bowl. And to that we're going to place in one and a quarter cups of chocolate chips. Now the good thing about this is it doesn't have to be chocolate chips, you can use white as well or any flavour that you like. So you don't have to stick to just chocolate flavour. And then to that we're going to add in half a cup of coconut oil. Now coconut oil is rather runny at room temperature, but you reduce it just a couple of degrees and it actually becomes a solid, which makes it perfect for this recipe. So now we're going to place this in the microwave and we're going to place it in there for 30 seconds at a time on high and we're going to stir it each time until all the chocolate is melted. Okay, so as you can see, it is now completely melted. So it's very important, just give it a good mix around for about 30 seconds, just to make sure it's completely combined. As you can see, there's different layers in that. You just wanna keep mixing it until it's completely uniform. Okay, so once it's completely mixed through, we're gonna let that sit at room temperature, just to cool down for about 10, 20 minutes. Then at that point, we can place it in the fridge or we can use it on our ice cream. Okay, so our chocolate mixture is cooled down and I just have some ice cream here. Now I've just placed into a container, I'm just going to squirt some over our ice cream. Now it should take about, you know, no more than a minute to completely set. And there we have it. Now I said it would probably take about a minute, in fact it actually took about 20 seconds, it was that fast. But, listen to this. Yeah, that's just how you want it. Now you can keep this in the fridge. But when you go to use it, just put it into the microwave for about, say, 30 seconds and give it a good shake and it should be ready. If not, just put it in for another five seconds at a time. But let's see what she's like. Oh, that's good. It tastes exactly like the ice magic you buy from the shops. But you know what the big difference is? It's far, far cheaper by making it yourself. And it's not just that, it's also because it's homemade and as we all know, homemade tastes simply delish. And so does this, and I know you will love it. So give it a go, because it really is fantastic. So thank you for watching this episode of Todd's Kitchen. As always, I'll leave a list of ingredients down below, as well as links to my Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Home Handy Hints channel. And please do me a massive favor by giving this video a thumbs up, leave a comment and subscribe, and I'll see you next time for another delicious recipe.